What's happening guys, it's Bharat Nagpal for IK Android and today we are going to be taking a look at the hardware and benchmarks on the new HTC Butterfly. Now I have a unit over here which is running uh, Jelly Bean out of the box. Uh, let's quickly go ahead and run Quadrant and see what that looks like. So uh, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to run into system information. Over here you can see uh, that the device is an HTC Butterfly. Uh, we do have uh, the 1.5 GHz quad core processor over here. It is an ARM V7 processor revision 2. In terms of memory, we have 1.6 GB, not the written 2 GB on the box. It says that the resolution is 1080 by 1776. So I'm guessing it is removing some of the elements. It's not a 1920 by 1080 p display. You can see that it has an intensely high DPI of 540 by 443 and a refresh rate of 60 Hz. If we go into sensors, we have a bunch of sensors over here, a rotational vector, linear accelerometer, gravity sensor, gyro sensor, another accelerometer, magnetic field sensor, orientation sensor, a proximity sensor and a light sensor. So a bunch of sensors in uh, the current flagship for HTC. Uh, so I'm going to quickly come back to quadrant over here and I'm going to go back and I'm going to run a full benchmark for you guys. at the result over here the device is right on top with a score of 7796 uh, more than the 1x that's a highly impressive score for the device uh, let's quickly quit quadrant over here I'm going to also exit it from the recent app list and I'm going to run over to Nina Mark real quick and uh, let's see how this device performs in Nina Mark let's quickly run a Nina Mark first I honestly think it's time for Nina Mark 3 to come out because the score was topped in at 59.5 which is the highest uh, on the bar of the Nina Mark uh, dial so I guess Nina Mark 3 is due because uh, you can't be sure of what the result is because it was clocked at top of uh, the list so it was maxed out it could have been more but it's actually 60 FPS which we already know so that's good uh, that's a really excellent score uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to run uh, the final benchmark for us which is going to be Antutu benchmark I'm going to quickly run through this benchmark as well. This is possibly the first time I've seen uh, graphic benchmarks run without any lag whatsoever. You can see a total score of 19858 on Antutu benchmark which gives it a 5 on 5 star rating. We have a CPU that's rated at 8831, we have RAM at 3441, GPU at 6691 and input output at 895. So there you go guys, uh, this was a complete look at uh, the benchmarks on the HTC a butterfly that was just launched in India. Stay tuned for our gaming and full review of the HTC Butterfly. If you have any questions or queries, do leave them in the comment section below. You can check out our full details on iGand.in. You can also catch us on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, and do subscribe to us on YouTube, youtube.com slash iGand, youtube.com slash